Thanks for clicking on this video. This inno innocuous country lane here uh, may look pretty normal to you, but this is the actual road that got me into running. This is the place where I started running uh, properly in 2013. Uh, and this is a little village in Cambridgeshire called Grafham. And I'm uh, today going to take you on a loop around Grafham Water on the cycle track through a couple of villages. And uh, I'm just going to do some reminiscing because, uh, yeah, I had a lovely, lovely time living here. Only lived here for two years. But, um, yeah, let's go for a run around Grafham. So I used to live down this road. And there's some chalets behind these uh, trees back here. I'm going to put some pictures of the chalet we used to live in on the on the on the screen right now, so you can see what it looked like. Sort of like a Swiss-style chalet, completely wooden, triangle-shaped. Now there's some good shots of them down here. Yeah. Oh, it's so lovely to see them again. No oh, sheepies. Oh, these should be quite ugly. Look at their faces. <laughs> Proper English country thatched cottage there. Really lovely. Wow, I see where we are now. Oh, you're gonna see, I'm going to make a lot of silly noises on this, this run today. Look at that, stunning. Love it. So this little section here is where he used to come down with my little boy. Yeah, he used to bring him down here. He was really little, like three or four. We used to have a great time down here. It's great they've opened it up a little bit. Yeah, we used to come down here a lot. What a lovely little place for a fire. Yeah. So cool. So this is my fifth run of the week. Went out yesterday on a 14 mile long run. And this is my first back to back long run weekends. If you class nine miles as a long run. And uh, Based on my training that I've been doing lately, it certainly is a long run. Nice place to sit. That bench is new, can't remember it being there. This is the first time that I've done a back-to-back -back long run weekend for quite a while. And I could definitely feel it in the legs. But it's all part of ultra marathon training, getting used to running on tired legs. So, uh, got to push through it, body and mind at the moment, not very impressed. But if I get used to it, then it'll start to become easier. And uh, one way that I get through that is to just enjoy the views and enjoy the scenery that's around me. Not focus too much on the body. You know, you've got to come out of yourself a little bit, haven't you? And look left and right and experience where you are and be appreciative of course how much your body actually can do as opposed to worrying about what you want it to be doing.
unsurprisingly, this was my favourite section. And, uh, you know, coming through the woods here was amazing. So lovely to see all of these little sections that I spent so much time appreciating and enjoying. Get myself fit, or getting into the world of getting fit. As you can see, you know, there's loads of lovely different sections here. A laser bird there in the bushes. Never heard a bird sound like that before. I think this has to be the best view of Grafham that you can possibly get. This is this is the spot. This takes so many pictures, selfies of myself here in this beautiful spot. What lovely views of the water there. So peaceful, right? You can see how much I felt so lucky living here. That is amazing. Does anybody else not like running on gravel paths like me? There's something about it. I don't know what it is. Let's make nice of these little hills now because the second half of the gravel water loop is coming up and it's, it's basically all flat all the way back to my car. There's a couple of hills that uh, we're four and a half miles in now. About halfway point, we get to a car park on top of this hill. It's a lovely cafe here. I mean, the wife used to cycle that section of graph and that I've just run through, have breakfast early Sunday morning, and then cycle back again. Just over there in the corner. It's also the uh, main center for fishing, Grafham. Really big trout fishing uh, community here. And of course, we've got Grafham Water Sailing Club. Hello, Mr. Pigeon. He's getting stuff for his nest. So running through one of the villages that you run through, running around Grafham Water, and I've totally forgotten what it's called. Well, I can't remember what it's called. That's terrible. I guess it was 10 years ago. Oh, here we go. It's Perry. The Perry Parish Council there. Nice pub. That's good breakfast as well. And lunch. And beer, as far as I can remember. Lovely. Come on, Phil. Let's keep running. I think my SD card ran out of space there because everything after Perry didn't want to record, unfortunately. But that's me done. Coming back to Grafton Water, nine mile trail, uh, mixed terrain loop. It's been absolutely beautiful coming back here again. I've thoroughly enjoyed it. If you stuck with me this far, I really appreciate you sticking with me. Please consider subscribing to the channel. Give me a like, give me a thumbs up. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Take care.